need to learn sit stay, down stay. What, what, a week and a half? Yeah. It's pretty tough. Welcome to my channel. My name is Ed with Canon College. This is our first ever video. Um, I really don't know what to say, but hope you guys, uh, hopefully you guys enjoy this journey. Um, with this YouTube journey that I've got going on. Uh, I train all types of dogs. Been training for like three years now. Uh, Meet Blitz, by the way. So what's up, Blitz? But other than that, I'm uh, gonna give you guys content of like every dog that come in from boarding, private training, um, so forth and so on. Uh, but yeah, enjoy the ride. I let go. So see what happened? So it was basically pressure. So this is what I'm trying to tell you, this is important. Because before you can move on to a prong collar or then the heat collar, you gotta start off the dog understanding the basics. See, what did I say? Say nothing. Just try to get his attention. Right. So the whole point. So the whole point of us doing the heel from we do this. Okay. It's just so he's always looking at you. Does that make sense? Now, I don't give a fuck what's on the floor, what's to the side. All right. Okay, fake, fake. I always, want you to, I always want you to pay him when he's looking at you like this. That just makes his life a lot easier. Because if you pay him for walking and he's just looking forward and then you give it to him, that's what you really mean. That means you're like, all right, I just walk and not pay for Yes, right there. Boom. As soon as you looked at him, boom, mark it. Does that make sense? Yeah. Boom, boom. Here, he's looking at me. I turn, he's still looking. Boom, bang. Right? Start paying for the little things. And then, when we start taking a few steps, he's still looking. Uh -huh. Hey, Leo. Right? Very good. Talk to him, talk to him. Right there, bang. Fake, right there, good. Man, let's 
where it says A means this, B means down, and C means come. Right? So, use your leash. One, go, okay. Right? So as you look at it, okay. So that's giving the dog an automatic cue. All right, every time I look at him, that means I'm gonna get paid when, I, when, I, when we're walking. Does that make sense? So to automatically build that good behavior. Good. So do the heel, take a few steps, and try to see if he, he walks with you while looking at you. Yes, right hand. Go ahead. You turn. You turn. Try to see if you find one again. Bother. Yes. Good. Perfect. Do it again. You turn. Yes, right there. Perfect. Do it again. Yes, right there. So what I want you to do, it's kind of taking too much steps. So for now, one, two, three. He's not looking. Boom. One, two. Oh, he's not looking. You turn. So that's gonna force him to be like, I gotta pay attention.
start over.
work on the heel. That's that's pretty much it. And then um, uh, just try to practice, try to find more dogs. Like if you have like a dog park, you can go to where people got dogs. And then just try to train right here. And, um, and like try to work on that that people thing. Right. Just always keep them close. Always try to keep them like attentive to you type shit. Like, See how you sitting now, like looking at you, like take that to like public places. Cause bro, like I said, he was young, bro, and then literally in what is session with three? Can't make that shit up, man. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Alright, uh what was what's the next time for you? Uh Thursday? Next Thursday? What was your day? Next Sunday? Saturday, Saturday. Saturday, alright. See you Saturday. Just keep doing what you're doing now, just Try to increase the distance. Get more comfortable, all right? Get a long leash if you need to, like, just to be more safe. Because, um, and it, yeah, use that, keep that, just so you can practice, like, off leash a little bit, too. So, like, I know you be seeing me, like, I got this little short leash, but, like, I just be having that confidence to be like, all right, I know the dog is not going to do shit. You know what I'm saying? But always stay safe, though, at the end of the day. Um, yeah, bro. I'm doing good. I'm doing good. And just work on being more vocal. That's one thing you gotta work on. Like, be fun, bro. Like, get that, get that extra gear out of them. You know what I'm saying? Because if you're just like, taking those steps back, you're doing the heel, like, bro, the little pep stuff. stuff. Like, I'm not asking you to run three miles, but you know what I'm saying? A little giddy, like, you could skip it. You know what I'm saying? Like. As long as just to get them like excited, like just to work. Like it's one thing, yeah, the dog listen to you, but if the dog's listening to you and then the, like the dog's just like, they feel like doing it, then it really don't mean anything. You know what I'm saying? Always keep it fun. And then, uh, try to pay him as soon as he does something good, all right? And then slowly uh, take away the food slowly. You know, as we get, as the session goes on, we'll talk about that, but uh, yeah, bro. I did a good for only the third session, bro. You, everything I taught you, bro. You came in here and, and actually put in the work. 